Okay, guys, I put out the video on how to farm the Ring of Malevolence, and now I'm putting out the video on how to farm the Sage Stone Ring. Let's go. Okay, to start this off, you're going to be re-rolling your adventure mode to Yisha, and you're going to be looking for the Red Throne starting point. Now, once you spawn in, progress your way forward until you get into the next area. Just follow my path here. Now, when I made the Ring of Malevolence farm video, it was really easy because the great sewers are really compact and small, and it's very easy to spot the ring. However, with this one, it's a little different where it's not a compact area, but I do have a pretty good method on just how to find it. Also, I would say this farm is just as fast as the Malevolent Ring farm. Now, upon going through that door, you will be in the Withering Wheel, and it will always be the Withering Wheel that will not change to a different place. Now this map generally has the same layout and the frame is always the same and I will explain what I mean by that. Now when I say frame, I'm meaning that this piece here will always be identical to this. It will always have this 90 degree curve. And when I say generally, I'm referring to everything in here that normally gets changed up. Now, 95% of the runs that I ran, the ring was always between here and here, between the middle and the end of the map. There was maybe two runs out of, say, 25 where it was at the very beginning. Now, when you start out on the map, you're going to want to stick to the left side. I don't necessarily mean hug the left wall, just stick to the left side of the map until you get to that corner, the 90 degree turn. Now, after this point, if you have it, you can turn on your treasure hunter skill to make things a little bit easier. But what you're going to do is you're going to stick to the left side and move all the way down to the door. Then you're going to turn around 180 degrees and continue back hugging the left side again so that you're coming up on the other side of what you came down. You don't really want to have to press up into this area here unless you really have to and haven't found it at all yet. Now I'm going to throw a normal run in here just so you can see how a normal run should look. And all in all, I think it's just about two and a half minutes for the run, which isn't bad at all.
Here's a couple extra shots of where the ring was located while I was filming this video. And then finally, when I found the ring itself doing the farm, I had searched the entire map because I missed it. It was at the very beginning, so make sure you pay attention at the very beginning or you might be searching the whole map. Okay, guys, that is it. I hope this helps some of you guys find the ring. And if it does, please do me that big favor and hit that subscribe button. If you have any questions or any comments, leave them down below. Hit that like button. And as always, have yourselves an excellent day. <laughs>